slightly damned. Wait, that's all you wanted me to say? You couldn't think of a better opening than this? <sighs> a few days later... Salutations, Rhea. Where's Moro? Hello, Death. Moro was off rearranging his rock collection. Did you know he made a big mountain of them just so he could show off before I arrived? I guess he wanted to make a good impression or something. It's kind of cute, in a weird, moronic sense. Ah, uh, how adorable! Uh, you two are becoming such good friends! Hi, Death! Hmm. Hello, Moro. Are you well? Thaddeus says hi! Hey, Death. I have a question while you're here. Why is it that I don't need to eat at all in the afterlife? And what about Buaro? I've never seen him eat anything at all in all the time I've been here. Unless he's been eating rocks. It is actually quite simple, really. You do not starve because you are not a spirit in harsh punishment. Souls more damned than you starve, thirst, and suffer from their cause of death with immense pain. Your wound would hurt too, if you were in hell. Do you taste good, Thaddeus? As for the demons, as natural residents of hell, they are protected by the power of Sindel in this realm. They never have to eat or drink nourishment, although some do regardless. Uh, Bolaro, stop! This, this is the same for angels that reside in heaven with Gaia. I am glad to see that you are well. I have to go now. No more eating rocks, okay, Waro? Okay! What is that? Eh? You mean that thing isn't normal? I've already seen it at least once since I came here. It is most definitely not normal. And I'm going to find out exactly what it really is! Cerberus! I demand that you tell me what that bright light was! If you do not, I will find out for myself in hell! Who are you to demand such things from us? We are not afraid of a pathetic creature such as yourself. We deny any knowledge of this light of which you speak. But rest assured, you will not be getting into hell on our watch. Has the responsibility of being the Reaper caused you to forget the terms of our deal so soon after only a few short years? Or perhaps you have underestimated our intelligence. We are not as naive as you think. We know where she is, and we will not hesitate to strike. You may be deaf, but you are not our master. Be gone, and know your place. Man, that seemed pretty upset when he left. I wonder why. Yeah. Earlier... I love you too. Man, I think I heard my ribs break! Nope. <laughs> That was my spine. Everyone is upset. Huh? Hiratu, Sakido, and now Death are all unhappy. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. Maybe I should actually try to cheer Buaro up. Wanna play a game, Buaro? Uh, okay! Ready? Playing catch with Thaddeus? Well, this should be pretty safe. <laughs> Man, why do I even bother with him? That kid is totally hopeless. But now I am kind of bored. I wonder what there is to do. Hey, wait a minute. Isn't this the rock where Boro keeps all his personal junk? This is too heavy for me to lift. Oh, I know. Aha! Here we go. Normally I'd feel guilty about going through someone's stuff without permission. But after all the crap he has put me through? Now let's see... What's in here? Huh? What language is this written in? I can't read a word of it! Hell, I don't even know if I'm holding the book upside down! Ray, I'm sorry that Thaddeus hit you in the face! I, I know she didn't mean it, and... And I hope you're not mad at us. Nah, I'm okay now that my nose stopped bleeding. By the way, what language is this? I can't read anything written in this book of yours. Hey, that's my stuff! You can't just... Wait, you said you can't read it at all? Nope, not a word. Can you understand it? No. Then why do you keep such a worthless thing? 
What a waste of time. Oh well. At least I found that shiny white feather you like so much again. Give it back! Whoops! Too slow! You gotta be faster than that to catch me! Jeez, I used to play keep away like this all the time in my village with my nest siblings. But you're the worst player I've ever seen! And my buddy Ramirez was asleep over half the time. I feel bad for you. So stand up, and I'll tell you what. I'll give you the chance to trade me for your precious feather. I don't want any old rocks or bones. I want something that looks like it's actually worth something. I'll take... Your star necklace! Huh? But... No! Ah! Well, I'll hold myself to it anyway! <laughs> Too slow again! <gasps> hmm? God damn it, is he crying? Uh, just when I was starting to have fun. Hey, Boro, are you alright? You can have your white feather and star necklace back for real now if you want. That can't be a raw to. I guess it wouldn't hurt to check on them. <gasps> She's dead? <laughs> it's just like before. No, I can't think about that. Things have changed. I have the sun. I need to calm down. I guess he heard me. I'm out of practice. Well, that took more out of me than I thought it would. What do I do now? If I leave Bawaro the way he is, he'll kill himself from exhaustion. But what can I do? what it does. Buaro must go berserk without it. And the only one who would have taken it is Rhea. <laughs> the best way to get to Rhea is by flying. Looks like he's about to breathe fire again. Now is my chance. Now or never! <laughs> it's only me. You can relax now. Hey, wait! Why am I alive? Well, since I'm in hell, I guess I'm still dead. But still... Damned souls such as yourself can die in hell, but are always back to normal by the next morning. It's so they can be tortured to death repeatedly. The same is not true for demons, however. For us, death is permanent, and there is no afterlife for demons. That's... sick! But where's Buaro? And why did he get all crazy psycho on me?! He's probably crying by himself somewhere. He was very distressed when I told him that he murdered you. As for his berserk behavior yesterday, in times of extreme anger, stress, and danger, demons may go into a blind, uncontrollable rage. 
Their bodies are pushed to their extreme limit to make them very powerful. They lose all thoughts for self-preservation and kill anything, everything in their way until they die of exhaustion. But Bawaru is a special case. He was born so that he was always in that nightmarish state. The idiot that you know is not the real Buwaru. But the only thing that keeps him sane is the star he wears around his neck. The very one that you took from him for some reason. Wow. D- does your sun necklace do the same? Oh, I forgot I still had this out. No, my pendant is different from Buwaru's. Hey, when Buwaru was berserk, he killed me instantly. If you say he's feeling regretful, then that means he's sane, right? Then how did you manage to defeat him without taking much damage? Unlike Buwaro, I haven't always lived out in this ring. I was once one of the strongest wind warriors in hell, until I deserted my kind and moved out to this abandoned place for personal reasons. Plus, since Buwaro has lived alone almost all his life, he has never trained for any sort of combat. Even if being berserk makes a demon much stronger, it can only do so much with such a weak body. Jeez, all this is a lot to take in all at once. So, Sakido, what do you think the meaning of life is? Why are you asking me? Whoa! <laughs> you just seem to have an answer for everything! <laughs> It's a joke. I have lived a horrible life of sorrow and pain. For me, life is full of misery. Uh, thanks, Captain Killjoy. This place is so freaking depressing, I could probably drive a puppy to suicide. So, demons don't really come back when they die? If we did, then there would be many veterans from the war in hell right now. So you mean the war between heaven and hell really happened? Wow. Oh well. I was kind of looking forward to killing Buwaro. <laughs> I mean, Buwaro was the one who killed me, after all. Why is Sakino making me make up with him? I swear, this place is totally fu- Hey! Sakido! Could you stop here? I think I see something. This is it! This is the book Buwaro and I fought over! The one that we couldn't read. It still has the feather in it. I put it back when I was still just messing around with Buwaro. Let me see it. Hmm, this is written in the language of angels, but I can make it out. I'll take the book back with me since you have no use for it. W wait Can I take the feather? Buwaro adores it. Thanks. Buwaro shouldn't be far. I'm going back. What the- Saki, you don't- Damn, she's fast! <sighs> Looks like I'm walking. Why did, Why did I, think I think of taking, taking back, back the feather? feather? I don't want to borrow anything, anything, especially, especially after, after what he, he did. did. <sighs> then again, maybe this death, death was somewhat my right? fault. Just, Just like, like the first the time. time. There, there he is! is. Looks normal. Hey, Buaro! Huh? You little freak! If you thought I was mean before, you're in for a real surprise! Don't think I'm gonna let you off easy after you kill me! <laughs> what? I was trying to be lighthearted about it. Oh no! Bawaro's upset! What did you do? Yeah! Oh, I see. Bawaro's star truly is what keeps him sane. Then why didn't you tell me?! I, uh, well, you see. I, well, it has been such a long time since... Who's that? Hmm? Oh, that is Beauregard Franken. <sighs> Fine. He was a very successful moneylender. But his greed ruined the lives of many too poor to pay back their loans due to astronomical hidden fees and interest rates. Luckily for the living, he has been dead for years from food poisoning. He would have been here earlier and not soaking wet if he had paid his fare like I asked him to. Humans bring money with them too? Yes, but not in their ears like Jakai. I told you, Reaper, I haven't any money for you to collect. Oh, really? What do you call these then? Put down my money, you filthy pack rat! What did you call me?! Enough! We have to get going. Now! Oh, bugger. You too, Rhea. Come with me. What? Why? What did I do? And why does everyone like to poke my nose? 
With Bawara as he is now, I imagine you two will not be spending any time together. I cannot leave you alone without a demon supervisor. So I'm assigning you with someone else in the meantime. Oh. Okay. I guess it can't be helped. After all, how bad could this other demon be?